The following is a non-profit fan-based production. Mogiko Castle, The Grey Garden, Garden Grey The, Wada no Hara and the Deep Blue Sea, The Sun's Curse, Poison Bugs, Ice Scream, Obsolete Dream, Carnival Rhythm, and Mogiko Castle Gaiden are all owned by Deep Sea Prisoner, aka Mogiko. Please support the official release. Last time on The Grey Garden with Voices. Hello there. You remember that bit when I told you about gods and devils being able to travel between other worlds at will? Well... Spoilers. Oh no! We're trapped in another world! What do we do? Take a walk with me, just walk it with me. Take a walk with me, come on and make your neck work. Now freeze. Wird mehr gefordert als von den Millionen der übrigen Volksgenossen. Für sie genügt nicht die bloße Ablegung des Bekenntnisses. Ich glaube, sondern der Spur, ich kämpfe. And now, back to the garden. Let's rewind a bit. Sarvis, did you see that? Yes, yes, that I did see it there. Who was that? In that? In that? Hmm, maybe the outsiders Lurky Cub spoke of? But there were others too, right? Yes, I think I know who. It's those four girls who live in Grey Village. Huh, but then... Could it be... This is bad? Hmm, probably. This might be fairly bad. Must we not help them? From what I could see, we won't be able to open the entrance they used. Oh dear, what do we do? Hmm, what to do? Good day! I'm a tear, Lurky Cow's pet cat! I love to sleep on Lurky Cow's lap. And I'm Arvis, Lurky Cow's pet kitty. I love sleeping on Lurky Cow's lap. Well? Well, Lord Kikab will be angry if we go off acting on our own again. Should we report in? True, true. Perhaps that's best? I think that's best. Perhaps. We don't want to end up like Wodas. Wodas is not someone we wish to end up like. Well... Well... Shall, shall we, we return? return? Oh, oh, Arvis, did you see that? Yes, yes, that I did see a tear. That, too, was certainly an outsider. Yes? Yes, an outsider by any definition. And the person who vanished was Edu, wasn't it? Edu, I think it was. Also, the girls from Grey Village were there again. Again, they were. Isn't that really bad? Is what? Aladidu? Oh, yes, it tastes awful. No, I mean the situation. It's definitely a bad situation. A very unappetizing situation. But just now, the great Edu promptly protected those two girls. Yes, but they were blown away. That away. Before we go report, why don't we look for those two girls? That's what we'll do. About here? Hereabouts. <laughs> A deep blue sea? Whatever would that refer to? Certainly not something outside the Grey Garden. <laughs> we should introduce ourselves. Yes, a proper introduction is needed. Can I only punch? I was sure I could do more. I can only punch. Seems someone got very lazy. Nonetheless, our stats are quite high. We are strong kittens. All of our stats are endless nines. Do not underestimate us. Isn't this one of our Divine Etiu stones? Indeed, it's broken. Who would do this? Not this way, that way. Ah, how silly of me. Those fruit look very interesting. What do you think they taste like? These fascinating fruits. I bet they taste like cool water. It would be nice to take some home with us. Yes, taking some home would be a treat. Huh? 
It seems to be someone's hair ornament. Perhaps the girl who was blown away earlier. So, could she be up ahead? She could be up ahead. So let's go up, onwards and upwards. Look, Garbus, there's the two girls. I see them, the angel and the demon. Oh, there you are. Are you all right? Are you alive? <laughs> Oh. Hmm? Looks like they came too. Is this yours? Mm-hmm. <laughs> ah, good. So your cacalbs. Ah. Never mind that. Et you. Ah, yes. We saw. We know. Y you saw? Yeah. But we came right as you were being blown away. Ah, I see. So, just who is that demon who did who knows what with our Etiu? I don't know. We were talking by the sea, and he suddenly showed up. <sighs> what could he be after? I don't know that either, but he said it wasn't Etiu. Huh? Then what? Golden jewels? I doubt there's anything of the sort anymore. <sighs> Probably not. How can you two act so carefree? Huh? Huh? Don't eh me. But we're not. We can tell from the mood that things are bad. Probably. From the mood. Hmm. Though I do think Etiu and all of her divinity is probably safe. What are you talking about, you idiots? No, <laughs> he always says that. Lord Kakao, I mean. You two are the biggest idiots. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. Um, first and foremost, I think this is quite clearly a state of emergency. Uh? Uh? Oh my, an earthquake! Maybe. Huh? Arbus, look toward the east! Hmm? Oh, what might that be? Something's there. Huh? It, it's near the forest we went to earlier. Should we check it out? Guess we'll go out and check. H hold on a second. Oh, will you two come with us? Hmm? It'd be wrong to leave them. I think that's best. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's depart. Wait. Let's, let's go! go. Here we are! We are here! Mm. Is this way right? Right you are! But first we should give them a demonstration! Come, let us demonstrate our punches! We should at least show our only move! You too, huh? Mm. Our is punch! To waste. Then what was that? Hmm. Hmm. What's this? Anyone feeling in a natural heat from here? Tell me about it. Enemies sensed. I sense enemies. Flame back. Flame. Why are they here? Ah, are they the ones Lord Cacao mentioned? Maybe so. What, what are they trying to do? That's a magic circle thing. It might be to get them through to somewhere. Hmm? But why? Mm, mm. Reasons? Give me a reason. in the world? Mm. 
Uh oh. Chill on. Where did those two go? Ah. Hmm? Turn around. Hmm? Arvis, we need to go. Yes, we must. They shall be thoroughly terminated. Let's go! Bat bat! Flame bat! They left. Hmm. Let's rewind a bit. Uh, hey, do you remember what you said to me? Hmm? Uh, just my imagination. <sighs> I've been remembering a lot about the past lately. <sighs> what goes around comes around, I suppose. Ah, <sighs> I'm tired. Without stupid old Wodas, I have to do all his work. Curse you, head angel. I'll show you what for someday. Hmm? What? Hmm? Wait. What? Mm hmm? Yeah. Got it. Broken stones? No wonder the phones aren't working so well. But who could a. Uh... Well, so it's my turn now. Well, this here's my level, and this here's my stats. Yeah, I'm up there with Wodas. I've also got a crossbow. As for my special abilities, eh, let's not go there. Today's a busy day. Got a lot of patrolling to do. Not hard, but it will be boring. Not to mention quiet. Ever since those bats showed up, it hasn't been the same. Ah, uh, what's going on? Hmm? Yeah! Ow. Oh. What? Yeah. <sighs> Really taking a while. Where could she have gone? Don't tell me. She goes out so little that she got lost. It's possible. No choice in the matter. I'm going to have to look for her. Forgot? You probably want to see what I can do, don't you? Well, prepare yourself for the greatest disappointment! For there is nothing for you to see here! Moving on! Let's start with the most obvious. And this lot! Big surprise! Could she be in my room? Lot. Wait a minute. Who lost my room? No matter. Finding God comes first. Perhaps I should ask around and see if anyone else has seen her. Well, it looks like there's no one here to ask. Perhaps she's gone to the village to take a stroll. Always told her she ought to do that one of these days. Where else could she be? I mean, there's not a lot of places for a god to go. At least as far as civilization is concerned. All I know for sure is that she's certainly not in this castle. Oh? Oh, man. Where is he? Grora. Perfect. Have you seen Etio? 
Oh, Sir Devil. Oh, never mind that. The head angel fell from the sky. Seems his throat's kind of busted, so we can't really talk. <sighs> hey, Sir Devil, can't you cure him? My talent is destruction, not so much repair. Figured. <sighs> Brother. <coughs> Don't speak. We can talk later. Seems like he's got something to say, though. Ah, dying for Ojizuke. <sighs> Just get some rest, please. No, brother. And you, she, you need to run. <sighs> Jeez, these are bad. Wonder who did him in. If only we knew that much. You really sleep in that thing? As you know, it you sealed me underground for a long time. So tight, dark spaces calm you down? Yes, I'm quite accustomed to them. If this is what happened to Wodas, then I've got to go. I have to find it. You what? If I can't walk down, then I'll just. Very well! Suddenly gone, then you come falling from the sky. Never understood you, dude. Huh. The castle's awful quiet, huh? Where'd everybody go? Hmm, and Sir Devil was looking for his god. Huh. Should we just be leaving the Head Angel to rest? Let me look outside. <sighs> He'll be fine. More importantly... What a weird devil. Aren't coffins for dead peeps? Heh, <laughs> guy's eyes are pretty dead. Hey, Sir Devil! It's rather quiet around here. Maybe I should go outside. Honestly. It's kind of strange that it's just the three of us. There's me, the devil, the head angel, and no one else. It's definitely those flame bats at work. But flame bats alone wouldn't be able to take down Wodas. They certainly weren't enough for me. Maybe there's some sort of queen bat. Or maybe there's some sort of sorcerer controlling the bats. That would make more sense. Still, I can't help but feel like we're missing something here. Hmm, Rose has taken a while. Well, it's a big place, and she'd call if anything happened. In any case, it's patrol time! Hmm, why is everybody gone? Over there? Here? No, there is somebody. <sighs> Who's that there? <laughs> nice to meet you. I'm Rieta. Now I'm going to obliterate you. Huh? Whoa! What? An earthquake?! Why would there be? Hmm, something's off. Yes, what could this be? What could this be? Whatever could this be? This is a mystery. How to solve this? Who?
<laughs> Just made it so nobody else could get in. Just in case. <laughs> You're the one who's responsible for these invasions. Invasions? Please, it sounds so crude when you put it that way. Who are you? Who cares? Oh, but the name's Iblis. What do you want? Want? Oh, well, to put it bluntly, I want your life. Hello? I don't recall angering anyone like you. Oh, well, this is our first meeting. Oh, well, no more formalities. Got nothing against you. But... I'll make you die. <laughs> what the hey? What's going on? Uh, what? Well, pass open, I guess. But what was that explosion? Yahoo! What? Oh, is he an enemy? An enemy is he. We have to take him alive like Lurky Cub ordered. Yes, take him prisoner. What? Isn't that Atir and Arbus? Why are they here? Why? Whoa, whoa. Ack, my seeds! Huh? Idiot! Eh? Hey, why are you. Uh, the girl from Great Village. We found her, Arbus. Atir, we found her. If, if, if! I don't get it! I'm gonna take you all down! Girls, you can return to the Great Garden through that large hole. Please hurry back. Eh? Hey, come on! Okay! Wow! Busy, busy! Ah, uh, jeez! Oh, take, take prisoner! prisoner! Yeah! Emalf, get a grip, please. Do you want the devil to kill you? Nuh-uh, definitely not. Meow, I can't move. Oh dear. You're getting in the way. Be gone, would you? Ah! It seems like even though we have high stats, we have no chance against the power of cutscenes. It seems that despite our stats being endless nines, we are powerless when it comes to plot progression. In other words, what we're trying to say is, we're blasting off again! Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> <sighs> now, shall we go? Yes, um. Oh, dear. It's a regular menagerie of idiots. Oh, my. I should be going too. Hurry! Before they catch us! Not with Atar and Arbus around! We just have to go through this corridor. And once we get out, we're, we're finally, finally going, going back, back to the Great Garden! Great Garden. Great Garden.
part drama, part parody, and all kinds of awesome. So what are you waiting for? Let's get this show on the road.